Hey dancers, welcome back to our channel. I'm Julie and I'm the owner and one of the instructors here at Broche Ballet, a ballet school just for grown-ups in Denver, Colorado. Today I'm going to be showing you an intermediate version of the Giselle Act 1 variation. We did a beginner version of this variation, so if you haven't seen that, you can check that out if you want to start a little bit slower. This, ver this version is going to be the full-on variation and it's going to be a lot of fun. Before we get started, please make sure that you like, subscribe, share. It really does help us out with our mission here at Broche Ballet to spread ballet to adults everywhere. Let's get started. So this variation, um, just like the beginner version, starts in a B plus. We're going to start here in B plus with the arms in demi second with a ton lié. That's going to go through fourth. The front arm is going to gesture. The other arm is going to gesture. So who are we gesturing to? We are generally about 14 to 16 years old. Giselle is usually pretty young. She falls in love um, and she wants to dance because she's so excited and happy that she's in love. Teenage love, it's wonderful, it's fabulous, and she wants to celebrate it. So she actually has a medical condition where she has a weak heart, which is super specific for classical ballet. Her mom is super nervous about her dancing because of her heart condition, but because she's so excited and she's begged her mom to dance, her mom is going to let her dance. So she is so happy and excited to dance about her love that she is gesturing maybe to her mother and to her love. And then we allonge to get ready for the variation. Then we go step on that left foot, a little precipite. So we're gonna go a little hitch kick, step, step. And then we're gonna step, pique arabesque, fi, fi, uh, fi through, little contretemps, sort of um, ballet-ish. ish We're gonna come around, in, in, out. So let's go from there again. So we are gonna do, uh, our gesture, ton lié, one gesture, the other, allongé, step, precipité, little hitch kick, land, pique arabesque, plié faille, come around, bring this leg up, in, in, out, then two beats, and then down. Then we're going to have three pas marché. If you haven't learned pas marché yet, we will do a video. We've done a video on our channel, so make sure you go check that out to learn that step. Come back here once you know that, and then we'll have that here in this area here. So we just finished our two beats, feet beat down, then pas marché. Step, and step, and step, and. 
Let's go all the way to there again. So we start in that B plus. Ton lie with a gesture. Another gesture. Allonge. Step precipite. Land. Pique arabesque. Plie. Faille. Come around. Two beats. Three pas marche. So pique to coupe back. And then beat plie. Pique beat beat down. Pique beat beat down. We're going to go on, add one more little bit to this. So we just finished our third pas marche. We're going to do a renversé. So here we are in the corner. Then we're going to go up to all of and then back to attitude, and then pas de bourree the rest of the way around. I do break this down in great detail in the beginner version. So go check that out if you're not sure what a renversé is or how to do that pas de bourree turning out of that. I do break it down in detail. The only thing that's different about this version is that we do a releve here, whereas in the beginner version, we just come up to flat. So let's check that whole thing so far. We do our ton lié one arm, the other allongé, step, precipité, pique, plié, faille, come around, beat, beat, down. Three pas marche. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Ron Verse. Up to all of the cones. Down to attitude back. And then pas de beret around. Then we're going to repeat. Step, kick through arabesque. So it's slightly different than the precipite because we're starting on the other foot. So we step with the right, kick the left. Brush, uh, uh, develop the right leg through, and then arabesque. So again, we do step kick through arabesque. Plie, faille, come around, beat, beat down. Two pas marche and two walks. So pas marche, pas marche, and walk, and walk. Let's review that whole thing. This is the whole first section. So we start in our B plus, ton lié, one arm, the other, allongé. Step precipité, arabesque, plié, faille, come around, beat, beat, down. Three pas marche, beat, beat, down, beat, beat, down. Beat, beat, down, wrong verse, up, attitude back, pas de beret. Again, step brush through, arabesque, plie, faille, come around, beat, beat, down, two pas marche, two walks. Before we go on, last thing we're going to talk about on this first section is the arm detail. So from that B plus, our arms are in demi-second. We ton lié to fourth. The arms come down through preparation. And then almost like a string tied to the back of your wrist, it comes up and then presents with very heavy elbows. I had the wonderful privilege of learning this from Gelsey Kirkland herself, who has a gorgeous version of this on YouTube. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Her version of the character is very humble, very soft very young, very demure, and she talks a lot about the idea of the beach towel arm. So like you have beach towels draped over your port de bras, very sloping shoulders, very humble kind of a look. So that's the port de bras that I'll be teaching. So from that B plus, arms come down, string on the back of the wrist to present, string on the back of the wrist to present, and then roll the elbows to allongé. Leave them in allongé in demi-second. Step, they just sort of flap a little bit with the, with the jump. Step up, and then through first, arabesque, plie, beach towel arms, come through. As we do our contratom, our, ball our ballet contratom, we change the arm to an effacé line, where that same arm as leg is here, is curved in front, and this one's out to the side. You're almost like looking over it looking over the foot with that arm. And then beat, beat, down. We kind of change the eight palm mall to the side. Beat, beat, down, looking over again. 
Then the palm marche, we're kind of um, floating with the upper body, kind of walk, watching where we step. Then we collect the arms through first for the renverse, through first, up to second, uh, sorry, leg goes to second, that same arm comes up, and then attitude, really leaning your body over that standing leg, and then back, side, front. They float all the way down to the bottom. So renverse arms in first, up, stay up, pas de bourree, float all the way down. Step, brush, through, arabesque, plie with the beach towel, arms come through, change to that F -A line, a palm off and down, two walks, kind of watching your foot as you walk, and step, and step. So very thinking, very humble, very young, very sweet and innocent. That's kind of how we want it to feel, like curiosity maybe with the feet, looking at them, what they're doing. You're very, you're kind of like young and playful and um, uh, having a little bit of fun with it. So that's kind of where you want to be looking and have that intention. So let's move on to the second section. So we just finished our two, two pas marche, pas marche, pas marche, and step and step. So we finish on the right leg with the left leg in B plus. Next, we're gonna do some attitude turns. So from that B plus, we're gonna step and then drag. So it's almost like a PK, but we're gonna be on that demi point. If you are in your point shoes, that would be up on the point. Um, if you're on your demi though, it's on the half toe. This leg stays straight, pull almost up to susu and then drop. I have no weight on my back leg. It's just dragging, coming along for the ride. Drag and drop. And as we drop, that front leg bends. It's really awkward, but that allows us to come around and present that leg um, out, out of it so that we can PK into that turn. So the arms, um, we finished our walks. As we step, they curve to a preparation, almost like we're gonna do PK turns that way, here and and then they're gonna open into an attitude turn. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like. We're gonna go drag and attitude. So how we come out of that, I'm gonna show you in slow-mo a promenade on my foot so you can see it, but it's gonna be up there on releve like I just demonstrated. So we're gonna go drag and change the arms. So this arm opens and this arm comes up. So drag and open, I'm in attitude, coming around, coming around. We come to fondue coupe back, ballonet and land coupe front. So as we're coming around that turn, that attitude leg comes down to fondue and then it balanes in as you change your body. So let me show you what that whole thing looks like. So we go drag and attitude, fondue, ballonet. So that fondue, ballonet, I'm still turning. When I come down out of the attitude turn, I'm gonna make sure I don't put my weight on the heel because if I just a, a paper's distance off the ground, then I can keep swiveling as I finish the turn so that my fondue ballonet will take me to this corner. So again, that whole thing, we do drag and attitude, fondue, ballonet, pique, pas de bourree, lower straight legs, arms come down to preparation. We get to do that twice. Drag and attitude, fondue, ballonet, Pique, pas de bourree, lower straight legs. Last part of the second section starts exactly the same with the drag, but then we do passes, a little basically chene with a pickup. So we go drag and passe, passe down. So let's break that down a little bit. I'll show you one promenade on flat foot so I can go super slow. Drag and passe. Passe front, up and over, and B plus to this corner. So again, super slow-mo with the arms, talking about the arms. Drag, and the arm that's in first comes up as the other one comes down. Then I switch, and then I plie into a B plus, sort of like a curtsy almost, and then with that giving gesture from the beginning. So let's see that again in quick, in real time. That goes drag and passe, passe down. So doing passe back, passe front. 
and then my arms are coming up and around. So I'm going drag and passe back, passe front and down. Then I get to do the same thing to the other direction. So then I just finished here. Step underneath yourself, drag and slow mo, passe, passe, down to a curtsy this way. So that one in real time, we go drag and passe, passe, down, and then up. And then we've just got a couple of steps and transitioning into the third section. Let's put that whole thing together so far though before we get into the next section. So we just finished our drag and passe, passe, down. Then we're gonna transition to the third section. So we're gonna go step, step, pique, or second air best. You're gonna pique on your left leg. This arm's gonna sweep over and turn your body as you sort of linger with your head. Like you don't wanna go. It's like very longing kind of a feeling. We're gonna, so we just finished here. Step, step, pique, second air best. Then we're gonna fight you across the body. So let's do that again. We go step, step, pique, fight, run, 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 all the way around. Coupe, just playing with your little feet. Coupe, coupe. If you have a romantic tutu that you're doing this with, you can play with your dress a little bit when you're doing that. If you don't, you can just do demi second and kind of swish your hands. This next section, we're gonna do hops on our forced arch. You can do these hops on flat, or you can do them on releve, or if you're feeling super fancy, you can do them in your point shoes. So we're here, we're playing with our dress, playing with our feet. Then we're gonna do hops on point. They're little rond de jambes with that leg. The arm is gonna be here across the body while the leg goes hop, 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 four, five, six. We're gonna do six of those. So with every little rond de jambe, you're gonna hop a little closer to the leg. So playing with the feet. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Slowly turning towards the leg, attitude front. So that part where we're turning towards the leg, I'm gonna show you in slow-mo on my flat foot. So we did one, two, three, four, five, six. Leave the foot out. And then change to attitude front, bringing this, uh, this back arm across the body. Again, you're gonna kind of linger, leaving the head behind in that eight palm mall, so that you kind of end in this position, almost like a very longing uh, feeling. Then right after that, we repeat it. So again, from here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. All those numbers I'm saying are hops. I'm just doing them on my flat foot so I'm not out of breath while I'm talking to you here. So we've got everything so far. We're playing with the feet. Then we've got six hops. Body is facing on that diagonal like as if we were doing PK turns on a diagonal. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, six more. This time is a little different. One, two, three, four, five, six, and double around the job, double up, and then close front, coupe back. So that last one does a double, and then up to a carte with those arms. Really extend that standing leg as you reach the top of your a carte. So as we're finishing, double up, the coupe back. So if that écarté, super slow-mo, écarté, close, front, lift, coupe back. So on relevé, we're finishing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're gonna run, 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 all the way to the corner to start of an inch. So let's review that whole pass. We finished our drag and passe, passe down, step, step, pique second air best, fight, run, 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 all the way to the corner, playing with your feet. And maybe your dress if you're wearing one. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. And then run, 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 and prepare. Let's go through that last manege. This is our fourth and last section of this variation. So that manege, you have a couple of options you can do with it. Since this is the intermediate version, I will show you, um, we'll talk through the faster version of the manege. I like to do it a little bit half time so that I can really nail the ending of this, but you can do it double time, regular time. If you do it full speed, you're gonna do 12 PK turns. If you do it half time, you're gonna do six PK turns. When you finish, so you can do, depending on whatever room you have, you can do like a U shape, you can do a diagonal, you can do a full circle all the way around. Either way, wherever you are, plan to finish right about here, going that way so you can finish here in the most powerful part of the stage. So I'm gonna show you what a six PK turn diagonal would look like. So if I'm over here, super slow-mo, we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, and six. Chenet turn, two of them. Chenet, Chenet. Pick up your right foot, pick it up and over, and come down to this side. If that chenet, chenet pickup is hard for you, you can do a PK sutenu, pick up and come down. That sutenu can sometimes help give you a little squeeze with the legs so that you can find that passe as opposed to coming from the chenet to pick up that leg and then pull it, uh, bring it down to that curtsy. So we've got six or 12 PK turns, chenet, uh, either two chenet turns or a pique soutenu. Either way, you're picking up your right leg to passe, up and over, and then a curtsy, and then stand up to allonger when the music finishes, and then close. Run off the stage, take your bows, whatever you wanna do after that. So let's talk through the entire variation, and then we'll give it a try with music. So we start in our B plus. We gesture, we tonlier with the gesture. Tonlier, gesture, the other, allonger. Step precipitate, pique arabesque, plie, spy, come around, beat, beat, down, three pas marche, beat, beat, down, beat, beat, down, beat, beat, down, up to all of the cones, attitude back, pas de beret. Again, step brush through pique, roll down, spy, come around, beat, beat, down, two pas marche, Two walks. Then the attitude turns. Step, drag, attitude, fondue, balané, pique, pas de bray, lower straight leg. Drag and attitude, fondue, balané, pique, pas de bray. Then the passes. Drag and passe, passe down. Step, drag and passe, passe down. Then two steps, step, step, peaking second arabesque around the corner, running, 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 playing with your feet. Six ballonets, a little rond de jambes, hopping one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, and run, 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 to the corner. Six or 12, pique and pique. Three, four, five, six, either two chenets or pique sous tenue, chenet. Pick up your right leg, up and down, and stand. So that is all four sections. Let's give it a try with some music.
All right, dancers, that is all for this video. I hope you had a lot of fun learning this variation. If you would like, we would love to see a video of you doing it. So email it to us at hello at brochevalley.com. We would absolutely love to see you doing this version of the variation. Until next time, make sure you like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Take care.